<laughs> that was a face that like, no, Dad, no. That's Whoa. wrong. <laughs> Hey guys, it's KJ, John, and Winnie from Disney Mom Life. Welcome or welcome back. If you like today's video, please give it a thumbs up. Subscribe if you're new. Ding that notification bell. And leave us a comment. With that, John, what are we doing today? Well, today we have another Magic Candle Company review for you today. And this is part two of a two-part series. If you watched part one, you saw us review the bakery, confectionery, popcorn stand, and castaway cruise. Today, we have another theme for you. We have a theme of Walt Disney World rides. Woo! So, start yeah! us off. <laughs> Yay! Yay! You haven't even been on them yet. You don't even know. Well, actually, you have. Winnie's been on Walt Disney World rides three times in her life. On the inside. But she was bouncing so all around. Guys, if you guys around. follow us, you know that because we mention that quite often. But yes, I was pregnant three times. I'm sorry. I was pregnant. Yeah, one time. <laughs> one time. In Disney three times while pregnant. <laughs> yeah, you were floating around in there, right? You've yeah. been, I think you've been on all these rides except one. So John, why don't you start us off? Well, let's start with a Walt Disney World and just Disney Parks classic, and that is Pirate Life. That's the name of the candle, and it's themed after the Pirates of the Caribbean ride at the parks. I don't really know what this is supposed to smell like. I'm assuming the high seas. Like well, the water. Yeah, like the water. It's a lot of that, like, bromine smell. Yeah. Maybe the islands and water and maybe it smells like a pirate. Well, read the description, John. Here we go. Pirate life captures the spirit and excitement of a high seas adventure with our pirate life fragrance. Featuring pleasant notes of oceanic air, fresh rain, and salty sea breezes. I like the idea of the fresh rain because I, I like on a spring day when it has just rained and the sun is now coming out kind of drying that rain, that smell that you get. Mm. So let's uh, let's give this one a smell. Mm. You want to smell first? Sure. It, it has that water kind of scent. It does remind mm. me of pirates almost like immediately. We haven't burned this one yet. Hi. So really getting that first Hi. review yeah. or first reaction, I guess I should say. I, I like it. Yeah, it kind of... It's fresher than I would have thought. Any of those Walt Disney World water indoor rides all have that kind of same, I guess, water smell. But it's 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 strange because you don't really associate yeah. a smell with water. That one didn't mention bromine, though. So yeah. I thought it would. Maybe Splash. Well, that's, well, that's the next candle we're going to review. The only thing... There was a Christmas version of Pirates. Perhaps that one had the bromine. I think they were both, but it's... Maybe. I don't know. But one more. It's very fresh. It's it's not uh, what I would have thought. Not as musty of a smell. I'm again mm -hmm. thinking maybe that's what mm -hmm. Splash will smell like. So why don't we... Uh... I believe this is one of their best sellers too because they always have it yeah. prominently featured on their website. So let's move well, along. Let's hit up Splash next. This one we had to get because as everyone knows, Splash will be coming to an end at some point. Hoping we get to ride it at least one more time before it, it changes to the Tiana ride, which we're also very excited for, but we would like to experience it one last time as is. So, <laughs> so the Splash description is, Splash captures the excitement of a fun-filled day of classic water rides with notes of damp air and musty bromine water. So there you go, there's the bromine. And let's open it up, Winnie. Can mommy open it? You wanna smell it? Smell, she knows how to smell. Mm. <laughs> I, I wish you guys could see her reaction. <laughs> can Daddy smell? Can you here face this way so you can show everybody what you, what you think? What a good smeller you are. Got smell. Oh, when he Wait. wants to put the lid back on. <laughs> oh, that's not a, that's not a good review. Is that? Think. I don't know when I'd want to burn it. I really wanted to get it. We haven't burned it yet. But I really wanted to get yeah, it because it. Splash Mountain is one of my all-time favorite rides in any Disney theme park. I've been to three Disney theme parks, both of the domestic and Euro Disney or Disneyland Paris as it's now called. So that is one of my favorites. So, well, we're having a bit of a battle here. <laughs> I, again, am not sure when I would, all right, I think you gotta know, would burn this one. Maybe just for nostalgic purposes. But it, it really does remind me of Splash, which I, which I think is nice since it is going away. Although, I, maybe... Who knows? Maybe, maybe the name Splash be. Mountain might still exist somewhere in the title of the ride, even after it changes 
themes to Tiana. Could be Tiana Splash Mountain or something Splash Mountain. Maybe I've actually said what did they give what the name of the ride is I yet? I don't think so. No. If they did, let us know in the comments down yeah. below. I can't remember offhand if they yeah. already named that ride, but we just know it's a Tiana themed ride. Princess oh, Winnie. <laughs> Princess and the yes. Frog themed. Yes. Which is also one of my favorite Disney yeah. movies. So this one, I would give a thumbs up for nostalgia, for I would give a thumbs up for getting it on target, I would say, and... And just one uh, word to the Magic Candle Company. We need a Winnie the Pooh honeypot themed yeah. candle. Winnie's in her Winnie the Pooh PJs. She so. needs something to like just own, right? You need your own scent. So next one, again, it's in the theme of rides. This is the Haunted Candle. And this one I wanted. Again, because one of my top five favorite rides is the Haunted Mansion. We're not at that part yet. You can open it. All right, here we go. Ready? You get the first sniff. <laughs> so the description for Haunted is, This haunted fragrance features a ghostly combination of cedar wood and classic vanilla that is beloved by all happy haunts. So let's open it again, Winnie. What do we think? Do you want to smell? Mm. You like that one? No, let me try. Mm, it definitely has the cedar scent, like it says. You smell. Smell the lid. And I can smell the vanilla. Yeah. This one I'm excited to burn. We haven't burned this one yet either. It doesn't have as strong of a scent as some of the other ones, which I like. It's not as powerful, so I'm looking forward to burning this one. I would say in terms of did it get it right, I would say it definitely got it right. It does remind me of that musty yeah. cedar <clears throat> with a hint of vanilla i was just gonna say something musty and right. damp and mm -hmm. spooky <laughs> if a scent can be spooky they kind of got it what did you think do you like this one i do i'm looking forward to burning it as well and <coughs> filling up the house with that musty vanilla smell this one i feel like would be better suited for like nighttime during the summer or in the fall that's what it reminds me of not it's not a daytime candle to me if that makes any kind of sense and speaking of that cedar wood burning kind of smell what's the last one that we have john yeah this one's definitely a winter type candle it's themed after another ride this one is called rome burning and if it's not obvious to you what it's themed after it's the spaceship earth ride at mm -hmm. epcot and it's a specific scene on that ride when you're on the ride and you're going past the Oh, wow. When you're going past the... Yeah, it's really strong. What is it? The, the, the Rome burning. burning city of Alexandria? Oh. Well, read, read the description, Johnny. Our Rome burning fragrance allows you to bring this memorable scent home to experience on a daily basis. This scent gives off a burning embers aroma that is surprisingly delightful. It is super powerful. When I ordered this candle, before I even took it out of the package... <laughs> that was a face that like, no, Dad, no. That's strong. <laughs> I opened the box. I kid you not, I could smell <laughs> winning. I could smell the candle. So, oh man, I could really, I could like breathe it in and strong. This is certainly one of the strongest scents that Magic Candle Company has. How to describe it? Obviously, it smells like wood burning, but. It smells like a summer campfire. Something even more specific. If you're a pet owner or a dog owner, this is, I don't know if this is going to sell the candle or not, but it has a very strong resemblance. To like a begging strip for a dog. Really? You don't think I, so? That does not. It reminds it, it, me of a campfire, not of a begging strip. It reminds strip. me of a, of a dog begging strip. It has like that fake smoky meat smell, which is sort of what a campfire is, right? I mean... Meat smell? Well, like a smoky smell, but a begging strip is supposed to be like smoked meat. Okay. I'm telling you, it, that's what it smells like to me. If you buy them or if you own one, let, let us know if you think it also smells like a begging strip. Yeah, it's... Alright, let's let Daddy have this one back, Winnie. <laughs> yeah, this is a definitely a wintertime candle. Yeah. That one, I, you really don't even need to burn it. I don't even know what it's going to smell like when it burns because... Yeah, you don't need to burn it. It is so powerful. Like, I just... You could leave. Smell it right now. You could leave the lid off and fill the room with that smell. You don't even need to take the lid off. Like, so, it's so powerful. As far as cost uh, effectiveness, the room is burning. You buy one and you can probably keep it forever. Yeah. <laughs> Just keep the lid off. Never burn it. So if we were to rank these four candles, John, where would you? How would you rank them? Ooh, good question. So I think the room is burning has the most pinpoint smell. Like it totally brings me to the. Spaceship Earth ride into that scene in Spaceship Earth with the, mm -hmm. the embers burning. But I think I like Splash the most, followed by Haunted, 
followed by Pirates and Rome Burning. Rome Burning is just such a strong smell. Mm -hmm. I don't know. It's, oh, it, I'm either going to love it or hate it when it's actually burning. I'd say I think Pirates is my favorite, then Haunted, then Splash, and then Rome Burning. So even though Splash and Haunted are two of my favorite rides, the Pirates, I just really like that, that scent. So that's how I would rank them. Winnie is... She's still ranking. Yeah, if you guys saw part one of this video, she was playing on the floor. This time she decided to be more involved, so... Yeah, you missed the good sense. You missed bakery <laughs> and sugar and all right, all right. popcorn. Yum, yum, yum. yum. Alright, well, we don't want our child to get sick smelling all these candles. So, she may not be happy about it, but toddler life here. So, Winnie, we're going to say bye-bye. Can you say see you real soon? Oh, well... Bye. Reminder that these all these candles are seventeen dollars. Sixteen ninety nine. I like to be precise. And that's before shipping. Right. However, you can often find coupon codes for fifteen percent off. That seems to be what I always get them for, fifteen percent off. And then sometimes they'll have free shipping. I think usually like spend, Black Friday. Or if you spend that. a certain dollar amount. If you guys like today's video, please give it a thumbs up. Subscribe if you're new. Ding that notification bell. And leave us a comment. If you have any of these candles, let us know in the comments down below what your favorite is. If not, are there any that we have that you'd like to try? Let us know. And with that, bye. <laughs> well, you gotta Come here. here. Oh, you know it. And with bye. that, we'll see you real soon. Bye. See you on board one of these rides. Hey. Right. Hi. <laughs> what do you think? You put your whole face in it? You're gonna have wax on your lips. She knows. She knows. <laughs> oh yeah? No. Yeah. Something was up on the What? It was like something, not someone, something. It was like a We're on like a second story, so I hope no one's out the window. It was like a leak.